thank you so much for that introduction. Good morning, everyone, wherever you are in the world right now. It is a great honor and a privilege to be sharing to you my success story in UNO Premier. Okay? In hopes of inspiring and motivating, especially our guests, our new invites tonight, this morning, this afternoon, again, wherever you are, it is my goal that you get to be inspired by my story. So, my name is Marianne Claire Gloria. And just like all of us were, I was invited. It just so happened, and it's quite very funny, because at the end of the presentation, I was still very close-minded. I did not understand anything. Because uh, what was at the back of my mind was just to listen and to let it finish. So when I got home that night, my mother asked me, where did you come from? I said, oh no, it's not working. I don't want to do it. And then she asked me, what are the products? I said, um, grapeseed, food supplements. Why? A week before I was invited to UNO, she was rushed to the hospital. And it was very scary for me up until this day. Upon knowing that she's been using one of our products, which is grape seed, but of a different brand and more expensive, I came to realize that why not sign up in Uno? I will be uh, enjoying discounts for her benefit. Okay? To make you understand more, uh, why was I close-minded at first? It's because at my young mind, it was very instilled that in order for me to get a very good life, I gotta have good grades. Even during elementary, I was already valedictorian because I really studied hard. I really sacrificed in order to get very, very good grades. From high school, okay, I went to a science high school wherein the cream of the crops were there. And now in college, my course was applied physics. Why so? I'm not the type who's into numbers, and in fact, I'm more on memorization. That's my strength. But then, why did I take that course because I understood that very few only would take are up for the challenge okay we graduated in our batch only five why is there a need for me to elaborate on that because I understand probably some of you who are listening right now have that feeling that it is not their line okay and probably are thinking that they don't have the skill the social skills of interacting they're not talkative so let alone me who graduated from a course which I deliberately chose regardless it's difficult. I hope you understand my point. So because I had a very good scholastic record, it was not hard for me to find a job. My first work was a computer programmer, although not my line. Okay, I was physics and then programming, but I realized, well, of course, who am I to choose? Whatever opportunity is there, then I should grab. Okay. Thereafter, my alma mater absorbed me. So it was very funny. Why? Because my teachers before are now my colleagues. So it was very nice. It gave me an ecstatic feeling. So I taught in college. So that was my situation when I was invited to UNO. I had two jobs. I was okay. And in fact, I also took an examination for air traffic controllers. All over the Philippines, I placed seven. So I realized this must be it because you understand most fresh graduates are always looking for their places under the sun. For me, to work in the airport as a controller is lucrative, very affluent, and of course, the most important thing is it pays good and it is within my line, which is physics. But then, Uno came along. And tell you what, when God has a plan for you, it will come sometimes as a surprise and even way better than you could ever plan for yourself. No matter how negative I was before, okay, I tried to just listen, I opened my mind, I listened to trainings, and right now, I am one of those who's been traveling to a lot of places here in the Philippines to share and share and keep sharing and keep educating and training our business partners nationwide about the goodness, about the beauty of this industry. So in order to succeed in this business, I understood that we should help our business partners, whatever it takes. In fact, this person here, okay, was a stranger to me at first. He was a seaman. And try to imagine he lives way, way far from where I live. 
but tried to imagine giving back to the trust he gave me, I went to his place and shared the opportunity to get there with him to his family and friends in their place. And in fact, in the picture, why did I really include this one? Because when we were uh, sharing the opportunity, we had a flat tire. So in this business, you've got to really put in the sacrifice, put in the effort, whatever it takes. At the same time, these are my partners in Surigao, okay? And this crowd was from my cousin, who is also my business partner, and this was in Bukit Nun. In terms of recognition, I'm so grateful to UNO, it's because they really will recognize whoever are working hard for the business. So I'm part already of the one team, the medical team, at the same time the Millionaires Club. So my point is simple, just have, you just have to work hard in silence, and let your results speak. Car results. In UNO, I had two cars. And I'm so grateful because before, it was very difficult to be mobile. I was just commuting and then bringing all the products with me. But right now, everything has really been accessible. I can help more my partners. And if you notice, okay, this car really had so much dents because just like in the journey in this business, you will really encounter a lot and you will reach far if you just persist. In terms of travel, which is one of the things I really love about life, uh, my first international trip, it was all expense paid by UNO, was in Singapore. Even up until this day, it feels like a dream come true. A year after that, I went to United Arab Emirates, specifically Dubai and Abu Dhabi. So these are also my partners who are able to buy their own cars because of this business. And this is what I like most about this type of industry. It is not only you, but it is also more about your business partners. Again, in order for you to succeed, make your partners also succeed. So this is my former student, and right now he had two cars at Puno, and under him, try to imagine, has a higher position in the Department of Education, uh, Environment and Natural Resources also had his car. So that's the try in this type of industry. It does not matter your age. Speaking also about travel, it was not only me who enjoyed travels by Uno. So this is the partner that we have who put up an office in Surigao, southern part of the Philippines, together with her family, December 2015. She traveled to Hong Kong. Also, she was able to travel in Maldives. She was together with the board of directors, with their families and their wives. Okay. I wouldn't be where I am right now if not for persons who always had my back. Okay, so I'm so grateful to Upline Warren, Trinity Dad, Red Lions, Grand Upline, and Mam Dayan Magano. Together also with our upline here in Cebu, upline Christopher Buscato, together with his wife, upline Marilyn Buscato. I came to understand why these people are so patient in really molding me. Because they want us, all us, they want us to experience whatever they're experiencing right now. It's such a great life that they have right now that they all want to really make us experience that. That's why they untiringly help us get to where they are now. Again, thank you so much for these people because if not for them, how can I also help my partners? Okay. And let us end with where we started. I did say it was my mother, it was her help that prompted me to sign up in UNO. But when I really understood the intricacies and the beauty this industry could give me and my family, this is the very reason, family, my mother, my father, my brother, and my sister. They're the very reason why I keep doing what I'm doing right now. And of course, looking forward to my own family in the future. That's exactly what I saw the first time I really deeply understood UNO. It's about the kind of life I could live together with my family, wherein money is not a problem. At the same time, we could get anywhere we want, we could have anything we want, and of course, we could reach out to a lot of people.
and this is really what I want in UNO. It's about financial and time freedom all together at once. So again, if you're listening right now, I hope that you had some inspirations, you got some motivation from hearing my story. If it's your first time to listen to this opportunity, I really encourage you, I plead you to, because you deserve it for yourself and your family, please sign up in UNO Premier and experience the very good life that we all deserve, that you deserve. At the same time, our business partners are already uh, doing the business. I encourage everyone to push on despite the challenges because it's really a fact of life, not just in our business. So push on and then just keep going and just don't quit because we'll be able to get to the point that we can inspire people. Of course, if along the way, we close the book of our story. So then again, I will leave you with two things. First, our life is our choice. So your life is your choice. Wherever you are right now is a result of your previous decisions. Wherever you will be in the future is a result of your decision today. Again, your life is your choice. And secondly, there is no lack of blessings. However, there is the lack of the readiness. The readiness to receive the blessings. God has laid out everything already for us. But every day, how we respond to situations, to stress, the negativities, is a test whether we are already re ready to receive the blessings. So again, thank you so much for your time. Let us continue to spread the good news this business has to offer. Let us continue to change lives because it was God himself who said, and I quote in Jeremiah 29 verse 11, for I have a great plan for you. And this is his plan for you, isn't it? Of course, let us partake in his plan and do his will and live in accordance that the more we are blessed, it is because he wants us to bless others. So thank you so much for your time. Once again, I am Marianne Claire Gloria. And let us meet more, okay? Not only here in Zoom Friends, hoping to see you someday wherever you are, in your country, okay, in your province. So again, God bless us all. Thank you.